guys. Emmanuel, how are you? Good morning. Morning, how are you? Oh man, are you upset? We woke you up too early. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said no, so you didn't go for a run. Oh no, I'm going to training. Okay, okay. okay. Right. Well, I am sorry we had to get you up so early, but obviously you are in a huge fight and we desperately wanted to get you on the show to introduce you to our audience, man. So we do want to thank you first and foremost for waking up this early and, and joining the live broadcast here at The Boxing Voice. Um, just tell me your excitement for yourself and your family when you got the call that you were going to be getting this fight because while Ryan may not be a world champion, he is a huge name in this sport. Yeah, I think the time I get a call from my management, I feel happy because uh, for a long time, uh, I wish this, but I don't get But I think I get this chance by Ryan Garcia pull out because he know he come and face Quincy Quincy. That's why he pull out. He, he, he choose Lukambo to fight by, uh, he go around, now he come back to fight me. That's why the time I hear the call from my manager, like I'm feel great, my family feel great. Uh, I'm feel happy. I think my manager too feel happy. Everybody feel happy with this fight because I know uh, I get this fight to showcase myself here, to write my name very well to anyone here to know me. So, your trainer is Javier Centennial, right? Same trainer as George Cambosos, the unified champion? Yeah. And how long have you been with him? Uh, I think four years now. Four years, wow. And how many years have you been in America or do you travel back and forth? Yeah. I go, if I, I, I come here to camp after fight, I go home. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. So uh, you live in Accra, Ghana, right? Yeah. Did you get any wind, any sort of, uh, has anyone told you that there's going to be a massive fight in Ghana between Tevin Farmer and Mickey Bay? Have you heard that news or no? No, no, no. Yeah, I got it. Go ahead. Um, yeah, no, uh, there's a big fight in May, May 21st in Accra, Ghana, lightweight division. Former super featherweight champ Tevin Farmer and former champ uh, Mickey Bay, former lightweight champ. Mickey Bay, they're gonna be fighting in Accra, Ghana in May. Um, we just we we figured you would have known or heard by now, so that's why we wanted to bring it up. <laughs> Yo, you are not a morning person. <laughs> did, did you freeze or what? Okay, Emmanuel, we're gonna keep it moving. We got some questions from the people. Uh, we got lids low. Listen, you got to come in with that same attitude and look on the face-off, all right? Give give Ryan that same look. There's no games. I don't like you. This is what you get on fight night because that, that looks like a, a serious, dangerous face right now. But I got lids low indicator, Georgia, that says, do you think the fight will go to distance or a knockout will happen? Yeah. For now, if I tell you something, I don't want to tell you something I don't do. Me, if I tell you something I want to do for you, because I don't want to anybody call me liar or anybody call me, anybody shame me. Because if you knock out, come, I stop Ryan Garcia. If you knock out, knock come, I beat Ryan Garcia. Everybody can like, everybody can feel that beating. So is there any concern for you that you've been out the ring uh, since the Mason Menard fight, which was in 2020? I don't think this fight, uh, uh, I bring excuse to table after this fight. Or uh, I, I, I say something because I'm okay. Everything is okay to come this fight. I don't want to Ryan Garcia to bring something to table. I'm fight for a long time and I'm sitting down for a long time. I get this, I, I get this problem. No, I don't like that because me, I'm fight for very long time. Ryan Garcia, I don't think he fight for a very long time. Yeah, I fight very long time past Ryan Garcia. You now, got Ryan Garcia. You have one month more than him, right? Yes, of the I, next. I think after that, after that one month, 
I'm fight like four years. I'm fight like two fights. Only two fight four years. Mm-hmm. I think Ryan Garcia fight a lot. Yes. That's why I told Ryan Garcia, I don't like excuse to table after this fight. You say I'm fight for a long time. Me too. I don't have excuse to come this fight talk. Okay, yeah, so basically you're saying basically you're saying you've both been out the ring for a very long time, so there should yeah. be no excuses. Yeah, yeah. Now, obviously, BoxRec has you listed with a 45% knockout ratio. Uh, would you consider yourself a puncher or more of a boxer puncher? Yeah, I think boxer puncher. Counter puncher or are you the aggressor? Me, aggressive. I'm fight aggressive counter punches. I, I, I do everything in boxing. That very day, I think people can see because... I, uh, I I I wait for Ryan Garcia, the boxing he bring to me. Now uh, I take the one boxing to manage Ryan Garcia fight. He come to me. He come to my top. Now I know. Okay, this guy he come with this this uh, plan. Let me take this plan to manage this plan to him because I know I have a lot of plans in my head. I have to, a lot of game plan. In my head, I have a lot of boxing. I know I can fight this boxing. You understand? Now, I I wait for Ryan Garcia. That's why, I mean, for now, I, I, I talk to you. I don't watch Ryan Garcia because there is no way I can go to watch Ryan Garcia or I type Ryan Garcia name to watch. You know, favor me because me, uh, all my 33 fighters, I don't watch anybody because I don't think if I go to watch you, because if you fight me, you fight me with different plan. Why, if you fight with someone now, you come and watch my tape? I don't think it makes sense to me. That's why I don't watch any opponent I'll fight with. But I think my coach watch Ryan Garcia. If anything, maybe my coach tell me. But my coach know me very well. I don't like to watch any boxer. That's why I told you that very day, everybody can see. So just to be clear... You don't like watching tape and footage yeah, yeah. of your of your opponent, but have yeah. you watched any tape of any opponent in the past? Or is that your rule? Like, I'm not watching it. Me, myself, I don't watch boxing. Wow. Okay. So you're not even a fan. Like, you don't even watch it on your day off, laying in bed. A Me, big... myself, if I'm fight finish, I don't watch myself. Oh, you don't I watch someone. Okay. Me, if I'm fight finish, finish. I don't watch myself. All right. Because sometimes I try to watch myself. Uh, I think my ten fight is. I, I I try to watch that ten fight. Uh, I sit down and watch myself. I don't feel okay. Now I know. I don't. I don't push myself to watch myself or to watch anyone. Okay. Um. How How do you feel about Ghana winning the World Cup? What? Yeah, Ghana, Ghana, everybody feel great. Ghana, everybody feel happy with this fight. Made Ghana it to the World Cup. Excuse fight. me. Excuse me. You guys made it to the World Cup, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why I told you now Ghana, everybody feel happy. Everybody feel okay. Now Ghana people wait for my fight because World Cup, Ghana qualify already. Now I come here to qualify for where uh, I say too. And uh, George, so excuse me, I call I called you George because I'm thinking of Cambosos. Uh, um, how many rounds have you gotten with Cambosos, and are you pulling any motivation from what he's been able to achieve? Yeah, I think I inspire with George a lot. The George tough fight is a fight or uh, only me. I inspire with George. George know me very well. George know what I can do. George fight. Uh, Serbi and any like I think George three row fight is only me. I spar with George. George know me. He know what I can do. But I know people don't know me. That's why the way people don't know George. George can surprise anyone. The same thing about me. By me, my style of uh, magic in boxing different. If you ask George, he told you. If you ask my Peter Khan, my manager Peter Khan, he told you. But let me promise you. Always, I want to tell uh, people this one. Uh, promoters and managers start watch Peter Khan because 
always Peter can try to bring different to table in boxing. Promise you, let me promise you, I promise anyone who watch me, in that very day, everybody can ask who be this guy. I know, I know everybody can ask who be this guy. Now people can, now people can remember uh, like uh, Peter can, Peter can do this, Peter can do, because now Peter can have good boxes in system. Apart from George Kamosi, uh, and French on Cruise, Zenda, Zenda, Tego, like uh, Peter had good boxes. By very soon, everybody can see Peter work in good work or uh, in good boxes in bring to table. For by now, let me promise you, I know me and Ranga is easy fight to me. But people don't know me. That, that's why people call me underdog. People sit. I appreciate all this because you don't know me. Why you talk my mind that good? There is no way you talk good about me because you don't know me. Mm -hmm. But this is the time I want to showcase myself to everyone. People can know me. But everybody can watch out. So <clears throat> you do understand that your biggest name fight was Mason Menard and you, you went the decision. So you're possibly an underdog, uh, an underdog because two other people in the division have stopped Mason Menard, Tiafimo and even Devin, Devin. right? Oh, someone you were going to fight, right, Devin? Yeah, that time I fight, that fight, if you ask my manager, I have a lot of problems to fight that fight. After fight, I'm not very happy because my performance no good for me. I don't do well for myself. But I think uh, I do uh, all my best to win, to fight. But I know I have chance to stop him. By that time, I have sliding problems. That's why. But I think that fight... So do you want to tell us uh, about those problems? You went into that fight with some sort of injury? Yeah, because that, that fight, I have injury with my shoulder and my hand. Yeah, I have injury. That's why. So you my took it. Down. You took that fight with two injuries. Why? I mean, I'm gonna assume you wanted the money, or is it something bigger than that? Why do you? Know, why do you know, still go forward with uh, a fight with two injuries? Because you know, I'm fight for a long time. I need the fight to fight. After that, the time I I choose to fight, I'm I'm get to my preparation. I don't have injury, but like. Two weeks to the fight, I get injury. My mm. manager tell me, hey, let me come say fight out. I say, my manager, I know you know me. Don't worry about me. I know the way I manage this injury to fight this fight. I win this fight to you. Don't worry about me. <laughs> okay, you tell me, no problem. Let me concentrate about you. Now, you you don't know me, but my manager know me. If I tell my manager something, he accept me. All right. Like, he agree with me. That's why. Yeah, I mean, no one knows your body better than yourself. So credit to Peter Kahn for believing you. And and look, you you were able to get that win. Uh, uh, go ahead. No, Emmanuel, just wanted to ask. There's been some talk regarding the catch weight in the fight. And was that was the catch weight something that your side requested? Or was that something that Ryan and his team requested? Or was it a mutual thing? Yeah, I know my side. Ryan's side requested that. Catch with, but if you Ryan Garcia like to fight with me, one forty seven, I'm okay. If you fight, <laughs> if you like to fight me and crucial with, I'm okay because I know <laughs> Ryan Garcia can face Ghana consequences. That's why I don't worry about catch with. I don't worry about Ryan Garcia with. If you Ryan Garcia like, I come down with one thirty to fight him to one thirty nine. If you like, I'm okay. Damn, so you'll fight Ryan Garcia at any weight class. Is it just that any you believe you can... Like, I'm, oh. giving, I'm giving that, uh, this thing uh, uh, advantage or that uh, chance. Why? Why are you that confident? Why do you think that you can beat him at any weight, at cruiserweight? Why do you think that you could take two, three years off and beat Ryan? He's so fast. He's got power. He's younger than you. He's the A side. You know, sometimes, you know, you, you, you sometimes boxing, it's just a normal. Your body tell you, you don't 
fight again. Or if you don't, if you don't beat me, why if I, I if I catch and uh, fifty years, you reach uh, like twenty years, there is no way you can beat me. You understand? I know Ryan Garcia is a good boxer, but not my side. The reason why if you Ryan Garcia like to fight one. And uh, forty-seven, and uh, like he like to uh, every weight, and uh, I chase him with Ryan Garcia like to fight because I know I beat Ryan Garcia easy. The way people talk about Ryan Garcia, there is no way Ryan Garcia fight somebody like me before. So you don't think he's faced anyone like you? No, 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 no. There is no way. There is no way Ryan Garcia can face anybody like me. Why? Why you say no way? Why do you? Why are you no, sure? No, 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 no. Choose one boxer, Ryan Garcia fight the boxer like me. Choose. A boxer like you. Hmm. Luke Campbell? What he 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 was an Olympian? No, 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 I'm far from Luke Campbell. You mean style wise? You mean style? I'm far. But I'm you're far past Luke Campbell. But are you Luke Campbell? But are you referring to the style? If you think, if you think Luke Campbell good past me, that time. And WBO mandatory me and uh, 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 Ryan Garcia. Why he don't fight with me? He, 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 he go away to choose Lukambo. I see uh, the way I talk. You don't know me very well, but that very day you see or you know me or you understand my topic now. I think that very day. I wish tomorrow by next week around the corner. Don't worry about this fight. Because Ryan Garcia no fight somebody like me before. People say Ryan Garcia have power. People say Ryan Garcia have speed. I wish that very day he come with that speed. He come with that power to everybody can see. So you don't believe in his speed and power is what you're telling me? No, 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 no. Me, myself, Ryan Garcia no have speed in my face. He no have power in my face. But I, I wish that very day everybody can see. Or uh Again, I want to double back to the motivation. Do you gain any motivation? Are you pulling any inspiration from what George Cambosos, your stablemate, and your trainer were able to do? Does that give you extra confidence going into this fight? You know something about me. If you me, and nobody around me, always me, myself, I run myself. You understand? That's why... If I talk, if you don't know me, you can take half confidence or half uh, like this thing. My coach talked to me, my manager talked to me, my family talked to me, my friends talked to me, everybody talked to me. But if everybody talked to you, you yourself, you talk to yourself. Me always, I talk to myself. There is no way somebody can discourage me. Only me, myself, I discourage myself. That's why sometimes if I talk, I know, okay, let me talk this. If I talk this, I can't do this. If I can't do this, I don't want to talk this. If I talk this, I want to do this. That's why. But I have uh, like any inspiration from anyone. By myself, I have myself too. That's why maybe the thing I say now, you don't know. But after this fight, you know everything I talk to you or everything uh, I say to you, you understand me. I definitely understand. Uh, uh, Peter, can we make sure that the mic is everything is good? It sounds like we're, we're losing a little bit of his audio. I do have some questions from the people. Emmanuel, let me uh, go ahead to the first one. Looking like it's coming from, no, we, uh, yes, Decatur, Georgia. Do you think the fight will go to distance or a knockout will happen? If you knock out, happen, fine. If you knock out, no, happen, I'm okay. All right. Uh, we got James Valdez in San Antonio, Texas, that says, Hope your experience in my hometown of San Antonio is a great one. We're huge fans of the sweet science. Best of luck. My question, what's the story behind the nickname Game Boy? Good question. Everybody asked me that name. The reason why I, I, I get a name, the old man take me to boxing. You know, I don't know anything about boxing. By the time he take me to ring, I do everything he like. 
That's why you say, hey, call this name Game Boy. By me myself, I know if I enter the ring, me myself, me, I play the game because that very day you understand the name Game Boy because you see Ryan Garcia, people say Ryan Garcia have power, Ryan Garcia have speed. That very day I control Ryan Garcia because me and Ryan Garcia play game in the ring. I comp I control Ryan Garcia. You see, Ryan Garcia can miss himself. You know, have speed. You know, have power. Now you see the game the way I play the game. That's why people call me Game Boy because if you have speed, if you enter my face, you know, have speed. If you have power, if you enter my face, you know, have power. I think that very day everybody can understand Game Boy because I'm the teacher in the game. That's why people call me Game Boy. He said, I'm the teacher in the game. I like that. I like that. I really love your answer, man. Uh, shout out to you. I get right. it now. I get it now. So I want to ask. I want you to double back. It sounds like you told me you were supposed to fight Ryan and he chose Campbell. But was it mandated by the WBO for you to fight him? Come again, please. Were you mandated, ordered to fight Ryan by the WBO and instead he chose to fight Luke Campbell in another sanctioning body? Is that what took place? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the WBO said you needed to fight Ryan? Yeah, Ryan. And so, Ryan Garcia scared me, ran away. So he ran away. So why the WBO didn't put you in with someone else? Highly he ranked me to someone else by that someone no one to fight me again. Who's that someone that avoided you? Dennis Dennis uh, Berichek. Berichek. Okay. Okay. Wow. So the, the WBO has just been having you idle then. Yeah. And was that supposed to be an eliminator or yeah. an eliminator? Wow. Yeah. That's an unfortunate situation. Uh, so obviously that's kept, kept you away from the ring as well. Yeah. But you are in Florida now for how long? How long have I you been there? Seven, six weeks now. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Seven. That's that's decent. Yep. You definitely have acclimated. So when do you get to California? Because no, obviously, Texas. Oh, Texas. Okay. So that's only one hour behind from your, from the East Coast. So that's not... Not bad, right? <laughs> no? You say? Uh, the time change from East Coast to Texas is one hour difference. Does that, is it, do you think that it'll bother you? No, 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 no. I mean, you know, Ghana, US time changes too far. You understand? Yeah, and then yeah, one hour is good for me. Nope, I don't have problem with time. Okay. Okay, I got a few more here from the people. That's why I told you this fight, I don't bring excuse to the table. If you rang Garcia beat me, he beat me. Mm -hmm. If I beat Ryan Garcia, I beat Ryan Garcia. I don't like Ryan Garcia bring excuse to the table. But I, uh, I want to uh, I want to say something. I want to everybody watch this fight clear for me. And uh, everybody which watch this fight to witness this fight. Because I know what I can bring to the table that very night. Absolutely. Uh, Alejandro Vega, uh, who says, welcome to the show. How would you describe your boxing style and what you do best? So what's your best attribute? This thing always people ask me. You know, let me tell you something. I have plenty boxing in my head. Mm -hmm. Sorry. That's why, you know, people call me Game Boy. That's why I told you the game where you don't understand now. By the time I enter the ring, you understand the game or the game boy because I have a lot of stuff like uh, seven, six fighters in my head. That's why I don't like to watch any opponent, any fight you bring to table. I know the fight I used to manage that fight for you. You understand that? That's why I don't like to fight. But I have plenty drinking master, uh, tai chi, I have power boxing, I have uh, uh, movement, I have a lot of boxing. That very day you see. Did you say drunken master? That very day you see tai chi and drinking master. So 
to be clear, let me tell you something. So if so wait, like, so wait, to be clear, you you're like, saying wait, you're, wait, okay, wait, let ahead. me tell you something. If you like, eh? Tell me, Tego, this round, I want to see the drinking master or Tai Chi. Uh, tell me now. And Matt and the world. Oh! And so, day, let me see you and Arena and tell me, Tego, I round one, you told me, or round two, or round three. I like round four, round this to do the drinking master. Let me see. No I way. See you. You, you're not going to remember. You won't remember. Me? Yeah. Oh. Me, I don't enter the ring. I, I I say something, you told me something. I don't know. Me always, if I enter the All ring. All right, I, round I, five. I, round five, drunken master. Let's see it. Okay, that's good for you. So you... Mark, so you, If I don't do that one after fight, come in this show again and shame me. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, uh, did you watch... Emmanuel Augustus, how'd you learn the drunken man, m m drunken master style? Then, if you don't watch tape, that very day you see. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna wait for uh, April. Round five. Round five. That very day, I want to see you in arena, and you come and remember me again, Tego or Game Boy. You know, I told you the last time I need round five drink game master. That very day, remember me. All right. I'm going to be, we're going to be uh, yeah. tuned in for that if one. Anybody like in this time, tell me, tell me now. And that very day, I want to see that person to remember me again. If you, uh, people, I get people 12. If you, the fight finish early, fine. If you, the fight not finish early to go 12 rounds, if you I get 12 people to say, okay, this guy say, I, I like round one, I like this fight, I like round two, I like this fight. I do all to everybody. Mm. I promise you, by now you say you like the drinking master round five. If I don't do drinking master for you, if you call me or if you see me, shame me. <laughs> or tell you, tell, tell shit for me. I love it. I got Ruin in 504. He says, do you think Ryan is taking you lightly. Do you think he's uh, looking past you, not concerned with you? Because, you know, Ryan Garcia, you don't know me for system. That's why. By me, I know Ryan Garcia, the time he come, he from amateur, he come to professional. I know Ryan Garcia. You understand? Yes. By me, I, I, I don't stay U.S. That's why. Ryan Garcia, why? That very day, you see Ryan Garcia think about me or you know think about me. The same team, you two, I don't think about Ryan Garcia because I don't see Ryan Garcia any special, any like boxer, like he can trash me away. No, no, no. There is no way Ryan Garcia can uh, cross my lane. No, 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 no. He can't stop me. Mm. He can't stop my lane. Yes, he come on board to try himself. Fine. But there's no way. I don't think Ryan Garcia can do anything to me or Ryan. Ga no, no. Why? No, 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 no. Why? Why don't you believe that though? There is no way I can believe that because my mind too far than Ryan Garcia. You think my your boxing mind, IQ is better than his? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My mind too far because I have a lot of boxing in my head. No Ryan Garcia style can stop that. No, 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 no. I don't think. I don't think. I love it. What are you fighting for? Did you leave anybody back in Ghana? Do you still have family there? What What are you fighting for? Why do you want to be a world champion? Because I have good friends. I have kids. I have two kids. One girl, one boy. I have family. I have, like, a lot of people. I, I, Ghana, I'm the king in Ghana. If you come Ghana, I'm the king. If you ask ask anyone in Ghana or any champion in Ghana. You think you're the biggest name in Ghana? Ask anyone. If I tell you, you, you think I'm lying or something. Ask anyone you know in Ghana or anywhere champion you know in Ghana. Ask. Wow. All right. I'm going to have to start asking. I didn't even know. Yeah. Or if you like, if you go my page, uh, Instagram, Game Boy Official, you see my things, you know the person, maybe he come here to fight, 
by you know if you go someplace people don't know you people don't know you don't force yourself try to write your name mm -hmm. simple if you write your name now people can start know you you understand but the reason why i like this fight i like this fight because Ryan Garcia have good name people talk about Ryan Garcia people talk about Ryan Garcia power and speed but i want to prove people wrong say Ryan Garcia no have speed you know have power if you have power or speed other boxes know me all right hey, i understand hey man you just really quick i wanted to know we Ghana has had a lot of great champions come out of their country. You know, Zuma Nelson, I Corte. What were some of the fighters that you looked up to growing up? Yeah, I look my uncle. My my uncle, because my uncle is a former world champion, Banta with former world champion, two times world champion. Uh, Nanaya Okonedu, do the marvelous. The third, the third world champion Ghana gets. Okay. What's what your uncle's name? Nanaya Okoneru, marvelous. Oh, marvelous. Okay. Yeah, Bantam with two times were champion. Oh, Bantam. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Was there anybody else or anybody who you saw and maybe was learning from or anybody else that inspired you growing up? Yeah, me too. I trained with Azuma Nelson like three years. Wow. Good. Yeah. How was your time with him? That's a legend. You say? How was your experience and time with uh, Zuma Nelson? He's a legend. That's why if I told you something now, you don't understand me very well. If you like, if I told you sometimes boxers, he told something, you know, do. Mm -hmm. Sometimes boxers say something, you know, you understand. Uh, follow Ghana and ask people about me and Ghana. Ask Azuma Nelson, ask Aikote, ask, ask any champion you, 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 you like to ask. Ask them, do they know you? Do they like you? What What do you want me to ask specifically? Because I'm special. Okay. Will you prove that April 9th? Yeah, that's why I told you, wait for April 9th. I come and write my signature year. But don't forget, you told me round five, you like the drinking master. Yes, sir. Don't forget. I'm Amen. not going to forget, believe me. You don't forget, <laughs> Emmanuel. You don't forget. Don't you forget, because I'm going to be uh, calling a live fight chat. We'll be watching. <laughs> See, let me tell you something. If I forget that style for you, I told you, call me <laughs> or find me and talk shit about me. <laughs> <laughs> We got Steve in the UK says, hey, champ, thanks for coming on the show. Which famous Ga Ghanaian fighters from the past do you look up to? But wow. you just answered that. Uh, so sorry, Steve. He did answer that question already. One other one from me. Is there a rematch clause if you beat Ryan? Do you have to fight him again? If you Ryan Garcia like, he likes seven fighters. I give him Ryan Garcia seven fighters. But on paper, no rematch. Paper. I, seen, I seen you look at your manager. What's the real answer? <laughs> I seen his eyes go like that. Go ahead. Yeah, because you know, anything you want to ask me, I want to agree with my manager before. Of course. Of course. You understand? Because you know, if you know my manager, I don't get this fight. Anything I get with boxing, my manager bring to ball to me. If you, my manager, say, Tego, get out for this camera, I'll get out for this camera. You know, you told me round five, you like drinking master. If you, Peter Khan told me, don't do, don't do drinking master. I can't do it for you. Okay. You understand? That's why I told you that very day. If you come arena, come and remember me. Hey, you told me round five, you do. Now, Peter Khan, too, yeah. But I know Peter Khan, he like you too much. <laughs> he, he, he pushed me to do that drinking master for you but if you now <laughs> me to me i promise you anybody if you now peter can't say don't do drinking master by me i like you i do for you oh man well thank you uh i'm gonna be tuned in specifically for that when we got one more coach myers and all the way in connecticut says who is the best skilled lightweight in your eyes me <laughs> 
<laughs> That's the perfect answer. That's what you're supposed to say, man. Um, why? There's a lot of skilled people. You got Tia Fimo, Devin Haney, your, 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 your stable mate, George Cambosis, Ryan Garcia. What so, separates you? What separates you from them? You know, the person, you don't know me. You two, you don't know me. That's why if I say something, I, 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 I'm I feel laughing. Mm. That very day, you see you see the skills. If you somebody tell you about the boxing skills, that very day, you see. All right, well, we're going to have to wait for that day. Listen, Emmanuel. Let me tell you something. I start with your program, Drinking Master. After Drinking Master, eh? Mm -hmm. I, I hope Ryan Garcia bring good boxing to table to me. I wish Ryan Garcia bring good boxing to table to me. Now everybody can see the way I have fun in ring. If I enter the ring, I have fun. There is no way Ryan Garcia can do anything to me. Ryan Garcia can do anything for my, like, uh, in front of me. The round five, maybe I start early. Mm. Maybe you maybe start the drunken I master start, early? I start early, by I start different thing early. By you, you say round five. By oh, drinking master, I start from round five. But I, you see the magic. Because I have skates past the boxes. You mentioned the name. I have skates past all of them. Ask because Peter... Yes, Ask Peter if you got a rematch. Yeah, if you Ryan Garcia like uh, no, 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 no. But is it in the contract? Yes. If oh, you it like, is, it is. I heard him. He said yes. Contract. If you like, he like uh, like third fight. I give him third <laughs> fight. If you Ryan Garcia, I need option in contract. If you like five fights and uh, rematch five fights, I don't have problem. <laughs> so you beat him five times out of five. Oh. You know, you, you, that really I is. will know. I will know April the way 9th. I beat Ryan Garcia. If I give Ryan Garcia a rematch, he don't fight. Oh, wow. So you're going to beat him so bad, he's not going to take the rematch. You will see that very day. You should, you will see. Hmm. What do you think George Cambosis does better than Devin Haney? You know, I train with uh, George a lot, but I don't train with uh, uh, Devi Henning. You understand? Uh -huh. I don't know Devi Henning very well, but I know George very well. I, don't, I, I, I can't tell you about Devi Henning weak point or uh, if you judge do this, Devi Henning no see, because I don't know Devi Henning very well. Mm -hmm. You understand? I don't want to say something I don't know. No problem. I think uh, the two boxes, good boxes, everybody can bring something good to table to fans to like two boxes. By if you judge win fine, if you uh, Davy any win fine, by you know, I think judge is my mate. If you judge win, I like. Well, uh, Emmanuel, I know you have another interview scheduled, so we are going to let you go. Give us your social media. I follow you on Twitter. I, I love the double end bag with the blindfold. I love all the shots you're taking at Ryan on Twitter. So give out your Twitter and your Instagram for those that aren't following you can do so. And thank you for coming on the show. Yeah, like Game Boy official. Any of my Game Boy official. Game, hey, you might be table official. You might be table official. If you go like my Twitter, Emmanuel Tego official, Instagram, Emmanuel Tego official, Facebook, Emmanuel Tego. Well, again, thank you so much. Can't wait to get you back on after the fight and talk about that fifth round, champ. Yeah, me too. I can't wait for fans to come early to come and watch a brand here, Emmanuel Game Boy Tego. If you know, you know. If you don't know, that night, you know. Yes, All right. Jeff, well, Emmanuel, thank you. thank you so much. Have okay, a good rest you. of your day. Peter, thank you so much. And uh, best of luck to the whole team, obviously, George and Emmanuel, who are both going to do battle in some very high-level fights. Um, we are... ...the video for free to hit the like, subscribe, and share.
as always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the Patreon.com backslash the Boxing Voice. We have tons of exclusive from Border Wars, Entitled, Betting Shows, the list goes on and on and on. But in addition to that, if you guys have questions for fighters, trainers, and promoters, this is where you can submit them. We will run out, get these questions answered, and put it back on the show just for you guys. Appreciate it. Peace.